Hello, welcome to the Steam Game Festival Summer Edition 2020 where I'm playing lots of the demos and this is nuts. I love it when you go onto the Steam page and it just says spy on some squirrels. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do. I don't really know what this game is except for it's... I, I like the, the colours and it's about spying on squirrels. Yes, that's right. You have your own research caravan and all of the squirrels of Mammoth Forest to keep you company. Pay is not much, but I think it's the perfect stepping stone for your career. Yes, I'm looking at your resume now. No problem with isolation, proven self-sufficiency, no expectations. <laughs> I'm frankly completely confident in your suitability. <laughs> that sounds like my ideal life. As long as I had internet though. See, look at this art. Pick up the phone. This is cool. Hey, Nagin. Hope your nerves survived that shaky ride. Yeah, I know. But the quad only fits one. You get used to it. So, welcome to Mammoth Forest. I'm sure you'll love it here. Such peace and quiet. Yes, yes, cash is transferred every Friday. Don't worry, we won't forget. I know it's not easy as a recent grab. Okay. So we have got... Bad signal out here, I guess. Explore the caravan. Like, I love this aesthetic that they've gone for. Packing straps. cuts out sometimes but I'll be quick everything you need should be right on your desk and I'll fax over the details of your first task now there's a cork board in the caravan for your research just pin it up there I'll wait pin the brief into the cork board okay read this carefully and I'll send you a map too so you won't get lost now can you see a small GPS device with an antenna Small GPS device with an antenna. No. <laughs> oh, here. Your first task is simple. We just want to make sure the equipment works. So, find the tree I marked on your GPS and place a camera nearby, pointing towards the tree. Then head back to your research station. Once you're in position, hit record on the deck and watch your footage closely. When you see the squirrel on your TV, print it out and fax it to me. Got it? Great, then you're all set. Right. Talk soon. Okay. Pick up equipment outside the caravan. Right, before we go outside the caravan, I want to look inside the caravan. Oops. Right. Pan. A gas stove. A light. Can. That's my dinner. Well, I guess we can hang stuff. Uh. Don't know what they're for. Oh, we can sit. Bed, we can't. Someone else's mug. Do we know whose mug it is? Or is it literally a stranger's mug? Because that's weird. Um, drop four of our documents in here. So we have the printer. The TV, where I guess we can monitor our cameras. Bed, no time to waste. Let's read this then. Field agent worksheet, test camera equipment. Welcome to Melmoth Forest Base Camp. First, let's check that the equipment left by the previous researcher still works. Just follow the steps below. Find the mark location, X icon on the GPS. Place a camera 
sit down, hit record, press pause when you see a squirrel, print the photo, fax. So, right, where's the camera though? I guess we'll find out. Put that there. Put that there. Um, operations manual. I think maybe these aren't done yet because they all just say print thing. Welcome, recruit name, controls. Alright, cool. So we've got shift to run, space to jump. Oh, okay, cool. So we can toggle the focus, handheld, and Instacam. Instacam, I like what you did there. No signal. Use dial to switch channel. Oh, cool. This is way better than I thought it was going to be, by the way. I just like the art style. I didn't realise it was going to be like, like a legit work thing. Project thing. Right, let's go out. Hey, new boots. Here's everything I can spare at the moment. Good luck with your research, Simon. This would be a dream, you know, for me. <laughs> Live, like, in a place like this. Just, well, on my own would be a bit, maybe for a week it would be alright. But with a cam, just me and my camera. And nature. And internet and a gaming system. <laughs> Place a camera pointing towards the tree marked with an X. I do adore this art. So this, this is camera one, so it'll be channel one on the printer, won't it? Press record on the recorder over the TV in the caravan. I was just looking under there just to see what that was. Just because it seems like everything orange um, you interact with. Night one, analyze the footage. Um, A back, S pause, D forward. Then I can go one print. Get in! This is amazing. This is actually amazing. I need to get rid of this cup. Um. Press the button on the printer once the squirrel is on screen. Fax a picture of the squirrel to Nina. Wait, I, I want to watch the rest of the thing first. Oh, shite. Oh, no! I'm going to have to print another one. Wait, there, I want to watch the rest. Not as good as my first picture, but it'll do. That 
those quick? Whew. Seems everything works like a charm. So now, what we really need is a close-up of this scribble near its stash. We found them in treetops, under rocks, buried underground, anywhere really. From prior research trips, we know this one takes the same route every night. So I'm sure you can follow him easily enough. When you have the scurry in frame at the end of the recording, print out a photo and send it over. Oh, and Simon mentioned something about dropping off some extra stuff for you. Maybe check outside. Cool. Lovely. Find out where the squirrel goes. Fax a picture of it at the end of the recording. I mean, that's pretty much what I sent anyway. Right. The last researcher told us that the male squirrel in this area visits the same tree every night. But we need to know which tree. And we need to a photograph of him climbing it to update our records. Figure out where the squirrel goes. Place cameras. Print a photo of the squirrel climbing a tree. Fax it to Nina. I mean, I did have a picture of it climbing a tree, if that's helpful. Or is this not the male? Like that? Or do I need to go move the camera? I don't know if I've just been let loose here. She's like, no. I can see the screw, but that doesn't look like it's final destination. Keep following while longer, okay? Okay. Sorry. <laughs> um I guess I need to go out and Move the camera. This is really cool. I love these colours. These colours are gorgeous. Right. Looks like I forgot some stuff in the first drop off. But I brought it now, Simon. Don't forget to take the TV inside. Put it next to the other TV. Ah, cool. And look in the bottom corner, look through the camera lens, isn't that amazing? So it goes off this way. So I need to just put this camera there. Yeah. Uh. Okay, so right. And the colors change as well, which is really nice. Probably not, but I've just got it in the corner, so she's like, No, stop sending me these shitty pictures. That's not what I'm looking for. I can't even see you. You're not looking close enough. 
Right. Okay, I need another knight. pile of photographs um go and move my camera imagine just being able to leave your camera out and not worry about it being stolen let's try that these colours are my favourite Comes down the tree, goes here, comes onto this screen, nailed it. And we're gonna get another camera as well because there's three things on the printer. Now, you've got to be pleased with this one. Ah, interesting. Looks like this one doesn't go very far into the forest. Hey, it's the middle of the night. Go to sleep, I'll call you in the morning. Hmm. Well, sorry you're not excited. I am. Go to bed. I love this game. Right. New tree marked on GPS. Find out where the squirrel goes at night. I mean, we can make a guess with the second camera as well, can't we? Is it bad that I'm just half expecting it to just take a turn? <laughs> like the um the vibe I mean, like to get scary or something. I'm gonna go and get my other camera. have a couple of good angles on it can't we oh I love this so much <laughs> I'm such a geek right record Oh, it comes right. Ah. <laughs> right, must go quite far if like 34 is it getting to its end destination. So. Oops. My bad. Uh, tab. Right. <laughs> it's just gonna end isn't it because it's gonna be like you only get five days in this demo 
So it came straight towards the camera. So I'm gonna go here. And here. Okay. I'm lost. Maybe one of these days I will become a wildlife researcher. Oh, there it is. Camera one is still singing it. It's gone past camera two. Damn it, it's gone down there. Okay, I know where it is. It's gone pretty far. Right. Oh, shite. Okay. Again. This is a gameplay loop that I like. So, it went down there. I might put this on top of the rock again, but facing the other way. Don't even know how I got on top of the rock before though, or here. There, perfect. Run! <laughs> so excited to watch these squirrels! is oh it's gone straight past <laughs> it's okay though I've got it on this one it's still going oh, I can still see it on that one damn right it's gone into them bushes there I'm feeling the pressure now because I feel like the demo is gonna end On the wrong way. Right. Feel like we're gonna get it here. This is the perfect, like, therapy game. Like, focus on a project. Try that. <laughs> I love how fast we run. Like, so excited to get back to the <laughs> cameras. Um, videos. Look how close it is! <laughs> okay! Right. Up the riverbed. Right. Up the riverbed! Whew, we got a day eight. I was sure it was gonna um, end on day seven for some reason. going all 
Right, wait, before I start moving cameras. I bet it's going over to this tree. I'm glad that the cameras don't scare the squirrels off. Right, let's try that, even though I think I've got them cameras pointing exactly the same place. Right. There it is, isn't it? One more, and I love it. So I need to move camera two to point where camera one is, but from that tree. Come on, one more, one more. <laughs> I feel like this could get competitive. This time, we've got it. Oh, it's so cute. Running straight past the camera. Oh my god, one more. One more. It's got a little hideout. Should I try and print a picture? That one there, just to double check. I can see the screw, but that's okay. Sorry, Nina. Keep while longer, okay? Sorry, Nina. One more, one more. <laughs> Last one this time. So, I need to move camera one now. To look behind that rock. This game is genius. There's a boat in the cliffside near, near the river. Maybe send a picture of it to Nina. Oh yeah. Uh oh, our thing's gonna take a turn. <laughs> Not sure. Right, wait, because um, the squirrel's gone in there, didn't it? What is that noise? Right, okay, let's try this. One. 
Is that whose cup I've got? The person, like maybe someone died? Well, this is a genius idea for storytelling as well because it's a totally realistic reason to be going around like tracking things it's also a good concept for a horror game not that that's what I want but um, I like that it tracks things there as well um it seems that this squirrel has changed the location where he stores nuts. Can you figure out where the new stash is? Take a picture of the squirrel's stash and fax it to Nina. Tonight. I think we've got it. Night 10. Oh my god, we're going to watch the boat as well. What if there's a ghost? Now this is actually creeping me out because is there anything scarier than something that shouldn't be there? And that would easily scare the crap out of me. There he is! I mean if this isn't the picture you want I don't know because I can't get my camera in the stash. woman I have followed him I'm gonna have to put the camera like right up to Ayana at least nothing happened at the boat One more, one more, last one. I still can't get over this idea as a concept for a horror game. It would get terrifying. Oh, oh, is something gonna happen because my laptop is not happy? I can't do a better job than that. Night 11. Nearly two weeks. vanishes into the thing so what can I do um, um, oops Right, 
does a squirrel definitely have to be in the picture? This lady is too fussy. I mean, if she would just check the footage. <laughs> you don't even need a picture. It literally vanishes into the thing though, so what am I supposed to do? Last try. And then I'll go and move the camera again. Yeah. Must be a better angle of it. What about here then? come out the other side, does it? Maybe it comes through that gap. Oh no, because now I'm lost. No, I can't get all the way around there in like one second. If this doesn't work, I'll give up. Maybe I was never meant to be a squirrel photographer after all. Come on, this is this is some brilliant photography here. We just need David Amber and we have fucking brilliant wildlife documentary going on. <laughs> I can't see this oh my god. What do you want me to do, Nina? Like that. 34. Okay, there's a few more seconds. Right, I've got one more idea, and that is just try and find somewhere where he might come out the other side. And that flag keeps scaring me. It needs to move. Last try. goes into here Stash. <laughs> my god, I just cut myself off because <laughs> I imagine like you know a mustache is on your face. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Why don't more people use the word nut stash? <laughs> oh my god, I'm cracking up. <laughs> Jesus. God help me. Right, we have got this. Do a thing. Didn't even think to go in like through the trees. <laughs> Though Come on Nina, I'm waiting for you. Only took me 13 nights. Oh, that that was so good. Why would it's not the squirrel? Surely, it's a person. It's like sabotaging the squirrels, right? Maybe like an angry farmer or something. <laughs> oh, amazing! Yeah, I love that. I love the art style. I love the whole idea of it. Really good. Proper relaxing as well. As long as you know that nothing scary is gonna happen. I was well relaxed there. Love it. That was nuts. Thank you for watching. And I'll be back with some more demos soon.